everyone, it's Libby from Meister Terra. I'd like to acknowledge the Warramai First Nations people, the traditional custodians of the land on which these videos are made, and welcome to you, your guides, my guides, and the universal energies. From what you have been telling me, uh, it sounds like the DNC has just been phenomenal. And when you think about it, I gather Michelle Obama was amazing. Barack Obama really dropped Mike bought it. Uh, who do we have? Hillary Clinton apparently was just sensational. And uh, Bill Clinton, I believe, also spoke. Um, what, what you've got to love is there was the president, there were two ex-presidents, two or previous presidents, two previous uh, first ladies, um, they're just uh, a current first lady, all speaking at uh, the DNC. Well, who did Trump have? Hulk Hogan, perhaps? <laughs> so, oh my goodness, and it just sounds absolutely wonderful. And someone told, uh, said to me, uh, one of my beautiful viewers said to me that at the DNC they, just like a Taylor Swift concert, they are swapping friendship bracelets uh, and the vibe is just absolutely electric. As someone who is not in the US from down under, I'm excited. Absolutely. So entertainment only, the energy reverberating around the world is amazing. So what I want to have a look at is I actually want to have a look as to whether Florida will turn blue. Now, I can't remember what I was watching the other day. It was about one of these uh, housing estates full of uh, older people uh, with their golf carts, etc., uh, signing up, hand over this, ex-Republican supporters signing up to um, work for the D Democratic Democrat Party. Oh. <laughs> what flew out onto the floor, the best of democracy, the healing, the the um, energy, the, the bringing of hope, um, the dream that can be hung on to uh, is the energy that is, is, seems to be palpable in Florida. Add in the fact that, gosh, and look what just flipped over again. I, I am really feeling that uh, Florida may very well, I'm just feeling Florida is going to turn blue. I just, I, uh, what's also happened is uh, where Mar a Lago is, um, certain ex presidents, soon to be illegitimate president, will take about eight to 10 years to be de officially declared illegitimate, um, I believe, uh, had, you know, road closures that are really inconveniencing the locals, just really annoying everybody. Uh, so let's have a look. Will Florida turn blue? I did have to chuckle with the sold out capacity crowd in North Carolina that Trump did a outdoor rally to. Apparently capacity was 400 people. <laughs> yeah, whatever. Uh, <laughs> which was rather amusing. But let's have a look. Let's have a look. Will Florida turn blue? And if my bias is showing, well, that's just it at the moment. Uh, I prefer progressive. I prefer forward thinking. I prefer united and and for all. And so, therefore, my bias is showing. But let's have a look. Will Florida turn blue? I think that's a big yes. Ace of Cups. New starts, new emotional starts, a cleansing out of the old and a bringing in of the new. Okay, touch wood, I am, I am right. Uh, what have we got? The Queen of Pentacles. Uh, this is about bringing forward opportunity, uh, security, stability. Oh, more than anything, stability, healing, nurturing. Uh, all these beautiful positive energies. So I'm doing this as an energy reading, slightly different layout. So the two signifiers are that, signifiers. So the stability, wanting stability of government, wanting their pensions and their Medicare protected, wanting uh, op opportunities to live their best life. 
Okay, so is Florida going to turn blue? The energies in the background are uh, behind the scenes, absolutely not surprised. The lying, the stealing, the cheating, the, um, uh, the, the fox in the hen house type thing. And then we've got uh, the dark money. The dark money, the machinations of, of uh, working under the cover of darkness, etc. So that's the energies behind the scenes. Florida turning blue. Um, yes, secrets coming out and being exposed. So it's more about, um, first of all, there will be more lies and uh, secrets that come out, just swampy secrets that will come out and be revealed about Trump. And um, it's just, I, I'm feeling a lot of these older Republican, past Republican supporters, they're old enough to look at the energy of the two sides. They're old enough to understand uh, that, I mean, it sounds awful to say they're old enough. Um, they've lived through a lot. They've lived, they've seen a lot. They've lived through a lot. They, um, I'm just getting the word gullible. They feel that they were gullible to, um, accept the lies that they were told. Uh, but no, I'm getting a no longer, no longer. They're actually, um, there's an element there that are really I'm going to say cross. Uh, that's the word I'm getting. I won't say angry. I'm just going to say cross. Uh, that they were duped. Okay. Thank you, guys. That's an interesting way of putting it. Um, and coming out of this, this, these, this working behind the scenes and money being involved is uh, setting up new boundaries in regards to the messaging that comes out, but surrendering, surrendering to the new message so that he's holding the ace of wands here. So this, I'm, I'm just really drawn to the fact that all this messaging is in the past. For me, wands are, are communications, ergo messaging, plans, uh, passion and careers, creativity. This is behind him. And he's bringing forth this new, this new plan, this new message. Okay, karma hanging over, seeing things from a different point of view with the hanged man, and with the light being shone on the snake in the path. Absolutely, the light has now been shone on the snake in the path, and they're seeing things differently. We've got a significant ending of the way things were and a start of a new beginning. Now you've also got to remember in Florida, I can't remember how many died from COVID. Florida has the same population of Australia. Um, to use it as an example, but under DeSantis, they basically had, had a free-for-all in regards to COVID and uh, especially those that were Republic, ardent Republican supporters. No, no, no mask, no vax, you name it. Uh, Florida had 10 times the death rate than Australia for the same population size. So there was a lot of those ardent supporters that passed away in uh, 2020 cycle. But it's also that, look at these, one, two, three, four major arcana in a row. The secrets coming to the surface and being exposed, looking at it, looking at the situation from a different viewpoint due to the snake and the path being exposed. And then we've got significant endings, new beginnings, and another major arcana straight across this top row. Uh, and this is about movement forward. It's slow movement forward, but it is still, oh, I love the fact, actually, I'm just drawn to the fact, that, and I know she's there, the female on the chariot. It's not a dude on the chariot, it's a female. She's, she's there, she's visible, 
and it is slow movement forward, understanding that these two sphinxes are carved from stone, but you've got the gold and you've got the iron. So the strength of iron and the allure of gold is what I'm being told there. Okay. Balance, moderation. Absolutely. That's what's been brought. Look at these major arcana and the manifestation of a new beginning. I'm just going to say, oh, and look what's on the bottom. That's what's on the bottom. I am going to put my money up. And I know I'm out on that limb and that limb is getting really shaky and I'm just going to use my pendulum and have a look. Is Can I ask a question, please? Is Florida going to vote blue? And that's yes. I'm not going to ask for the state level. I know DeSantis isn't up for election this time round, but he may find himself with a... I do see DeSantis actually not serving out his entire term, but he may in the short term find himself with a adversarial um, state congress. Cards. Okay, I'm going to leave it there. Love to you all. Take care.